to enhance the presentation of diagrams and help convey model context, Enterprise Architect supports the substitution of formal modeling notations with custom graphics, all while keeping the model metadata intact. In Enterprise Architect, modelers can add images to their repository as an image asset, which are then reusable across the repository. I'm going to create an image asset by dragging and dropping an image onto a diagram from the file browser. You can now see the image added to the EA browser and diagram. Alternatively, you can also add the image artifact from the EA toolbox under Artifacts. Once added to the repository, we can edit the appearance of elements. Right click the element and select Image Asset. From here we can locate the image in the browser or find it using the search tool. It's possible to add an icon to an element as a way of adding additional information. To do this, set the element to custom style from the context menu. Then in the browser, drag the image asset onto your element. Then select as icon. From here you can see the image added to the top right corner of the element. To revert an element's appearance back to its original state, right click the element and go to image assets again. From the menu, select None. Prior to version 13, the Image Manager was the primary means of using images in the model. In version 15, the Image Manager is accessible from the Configure ribbon under Reference Data. From here you can access existing alternative images in the Manager, as well as add new ones. On Model Elements, you can select images from the Image Manager by right-clicking on an element and selecting Alternative Image. From here I can browse the Image Manager. To set the default appearance of an element across multiple diagrams, right-click on your element and select Default Image. This will then bring up the Image Manager, allowing you to select your preferred image. Afterwards, anytime the same element is added to a diagram, it will have the same alternative appearance. Many models will contain existing images in the Image Manager. It's possible to convert these images to image assets by selecting the Convert to Image Asset button. It then inserts the image in the current package. For more information about image assets and other diagramming functionality, visit sparksystems.com forward slash resources.